Well, look, you can look at mine. Juliet Penna brought poster board and markers along with her two kids to the rally. I finally got to the point where I'm like, my silence is complicity and I, this was something I could do in my community and so I decided to come out. To support Black Lives Matter, and their anger over two more men killed by police this week in Minnesota and Louisiana. Love compensates all because the fact is all this uh, murder and killing is not helping our society. And in order to heal, you need love because love compensates everything that happens. But others got restless and decided it was time to move. Hands up, don't shoot! Hands up, don't shoot! The crowd of over 100 headed up Main Street. Alert, Greenville police officers stop traffic to let the marchers walk safely past the Peace Center, surprising those out for a quiet stroll. Nothing happened. They weren't inciting violence. They were asking for peace, so I'm happy with it. Congregating briefly out front of City Hall and then heading up North Main, where the group interrupted the band and took over the stage at the Friday night concert. Hey, hey if y'all with it, put your fist in his eye, keep him up right now. Black lives matter, small lives matter. That's all they're talking about is black lives up there. There's five white cops got killed today. I asked the organizers if they thought they alienated people by crashing the concert on North Main. Right is right and wrong is wrong. We saw those young men take their last breath on TV, on video. So if you think that was alienating, how you think those families felt when they had to bury those two young men? We all need the same. We all bleed the same! Another peace rally is scheduled for tomorrow night at 6 at Falls Park. John Lyon, WIFF News 4, Greenville.